This is my GA2100 SKE and I loved it when it was new for its unique clear case and strap. I've had it now for nearly 3 years and although it's still going strong on its original battery, the straps are no longer as transparent as they once were and are starting to turn yellow. In this video I'll show you how to return the watch back to its former glory and remove the yellowing and what's more, it will cost less than a dollar. I'll demonstrate the process on my clear G-Shock, but it will work just as well on any acrylic or plastic watch that's yellowing such as white plastics. And as a disclaimer, if you choose to follow along, you do so at your own risk. The first thing to do is to remove the straps, and with this model it's fairly easy as it has quick release pins. If you want to know more about this watch, check out my review after this video. Then remove the case covering by taking off the four screws. And here's what's inside of the GA2100, the famous carbon fibre case. Now I'm not going to apply the process to the case covering, as I don't want it to erase the printed text. Instead I'll give it a wash with a mild detergent. And I'll also give the case a good clean with a cloth. The product that I'll be using to remove the yellowing from the straps is hydrogen peroxide, commonly found in hair bleaching cream. This bottle cost me €2.49 and it will fix at least 5 watches. Doing a bit of maths, that's less than a dollar a watch. Lay down some cling film and apply it liberally to the straps. Wrap them up and place it in the sun for at least 2 hours. Turn them over halfway through. After about 2-3 to three hours, and you might need to give it more time if it's not very sunny where you are, remove from the wrap and give the straps a thorough rinse. And here's a side by side of the before and after. All that's left is to assemble the watch and the job is done. Thanks for watching folks, I hope that this video helped you out and I'll see you in the next video.